David. And I'd like to wish Neil Bright a happy centenary. I studied on the documentary photography course from 2007 to 2010. Um, my tutors were Paul Rees, Clive Landon, Ken Grant, um, Celia Jackson, Pete Davies, Ian Walker, Liam Devlin. And I'd just like to take this opportunity to say a big thanks to all the staff there in Newport because without them I don't think I'd be where I am today. Before I got to Newport I studied on a PLC course at Sion College of Further Education under Christine Redmond and Joe Sterling um, who really encouraged me to um, pursue documentary photography and recommended Newport to me. So I went um, with a couple of friends to the open day and when I got there I really fell in love with the place and thought this is really going to be the place for me. When I got to Newport in the first year um, it was very intense, um, a little intimidating at first, especially when we were told the amount of work that was required of us. Um, but there was always a lot of help on hand and great facilities to work with and again great you know, feedback from tutors and who were always there to help when you needed. Um, in second year, was we were kind of given a little bit more free reign to do what we wanted and to be honest I kind of, no wait, will I be honest or not? Alright, I'll be honest. Okay, second year was a bit of a write-off. I still worked and was creative, but I just hadn't got the proper work ethic, which I think got beaten into me by the third year. And so on third year then, we were really allowed to kind of explore our own creativity and really work with the whole medium and explore the concept of documentary photography in itself. And it really changed the whole style of the way I was shooting pictures, the way I was making images and I don't think I could have gotten that anywhere else. That level of exploration in terms of the creative process but also I would you say that strong work ethic that's needed to drive projects forward and to really develop a serious concept.